Eddie, I wonder if we could do something. Um, is it, could we look at the girls' skirts for a half a second? Or does everybody stand still for a half a moment? I was in England recently, and you girls are, are, are very conservative, actually, because the girls over there these days, uh, we've got to pan down a bit, gentlemen. I want to see the knees. That's the spirit. Uh-huh. Those skirts are fairly long, believe it or not, by English standards. The girls over there are wearing the micro skirts now. That's 10 inches above the knee. And the Frenchmen say now that come fall, the girls are going to wear skirts down to mid-calf. Now that they sold you all the short skirts, they're going to lengthen them. So what I'd like to know from the girls is, will you wear your skirts down to your mid-calf? Fellas, you're out of this one, I guess. This is a girl survey. May I have your name and age, please? Donna Wagoner, 16. And I wouldn't wear them that You wouldn't? Long. All right. Frank Vanderpool, 17. You wouldn't wear one, that's for sure. <laughs> Pat Chappelle, 16, and I wouldn't wear them. All right. Buzz Longworth, 15. Thank you. Wait a minute, 16, I think it'll look awful. Well, I wish you a lot of luck. Jim Miranda, 17. Thank you. Debbie Kane, 15. I wouldn't wear mine any, any longer than they are now. You wouldn't? No. Okay. Tony Hinkle, 16. Thank you. Laura Bravo, and I wouldn't wear them. You wouldn't, you wouldn't ever wear them. Huh? All right. George Foss, 17. Thank you. Deb Anderson, 18. No. <laughs> no, uh huh. Horace Hutchins, 17. Thank you. Peggy Wagner, 17. I wouldn't wear them. Uh huh. No, Peg. Barry Lawrence, 17. Thank you. Linda McClay, 15. No. You wouldn't. All right. I wish we could, you know, we're transcribing this program. It'll be tape recorded. We ought to play this back in about six months from now. Would you like to take a little side wager on whether these, if it becomes a thing, you will all wear your skirts long. You know that. In your heart, you know that. You won't admit it. Now here's news of a wonderful new candy mint for your breath, new skirts. Once again, here's Dick. Thank you, Charlie. Oh, let's take a look at the top ten situation. We'll, uh, we'll start down in this general area here. The fellows we just heard from, the Turtles, You'd Rather Be With Me, holds number ten spot, with Engelbert holding number nine. Paul Revere and the Raiders, number eight. Arthur Connolly moving uh, down to number seven. The Buckinghams, who will be here later today. Preceded by Neil Diamond, The Happenings, The Mamas and Papas, and Aretha Franklin. And this is the number one song. That's it. That's the number one song, The Young Rascals Groovin'. 